Hey guys, and welcome back. When we last left off, we were hunting in the darkness, and it's not going too badly. It could be better. It could always be better, but I guess considering our... Oh, there's the ship. Considering our current situation, um, it's acceptable. Let's just keep, keep scanning for targets. We're going to go sweeping around the ship. Okay, their ship's actually right in that corner. That's not too bad, you know. Everyone else, push up. Doesn't look like we can walk through the coral. But that's fine. This dude is really not in a good way. Make sure all of our fatal wounds... Yeah, all of our fatal wounds have been sorted. So that's something I guess uh, right what did this guy have okay not bad right so there's the sub where's the front maybe that's the front I can't remember this particular type of ship good to get the rookies in I suppose. Get them in first. Unfortunately our firing line doesn't have fantastic eyes on. That's... Okay. Not sure what design this ship is. I think I've got a mod on that randomizes. Yeah, there's that's the entrance. I do have a mod on that randomizes the layouts or the positions of the subs, something like that. So that does make things a little bit more interesting, I guess. Right, this guy's TU suck because He's, um, actually, we get her exploring. She doesn't have a lot of energy. So we're going to have to give her a few turns to rest, I think. What's that on the floor? Oh, okay. So whatever alien bought the farm there had two grenades, and the two grenades survived. I would have preferred that ammo to survive. But beggars can't be choosers, I guess. Okay, so this corner checks out. For now, anyway. Now, ooh. 31. Can one of the snipers get eyes on? Maybe not eyes on, but... If we can get around on this guy. No good. Jordani, you failed us. But H, on the other hand, 95% chance of hitting. Oh! He's had enough. He's had enough. He's out. Yeah, these rooks really can't move at all. This is pretty awful, actually. Okay. Don't really want you to move up too much more. That at a maximum push. Yeah, because if there's anyone near the sub, they're going to come out. And they're going to mean business. Hopefully... There's no one else. Yeah, so this sub, I'm, I'm sure the orientation of this sub is different. Definitely looks different. Now, I think they can shoot out up there. Again, I might be wrong. It's been so many years since I've uh, played this. Uh, 
drop the med kit. If we need it, we can come back for it. Someone here will have one. I hope. Yeah. Someone here indeed does have one. Right, take a knee. If anything comes through that door, light it up. Damn it, I don't like assaulting this with all these rookies. Not a fan. Luckily, not much going on in here. I would like... If possible, to get the stun person in. Now, one thing that's also kind of annoying as well, I believe, and I might be wrong about this, but I'm pretty sure I'm not. If one round from the weapon is fired, that means after the mission, that entire... Um, battery pack is wasted oh which I don't like that I think they should just keep that battery pack in all right let's start get, getting some people stacked okay we're fine Carefully does it. We're fine this side. Okay, get you round. We need the aquaplastics and the zerbite. Doesn't look like a big ship. <laughs> Until we go inside. Here he comes. Oh! Yes! Oh! God, that was... Did it say that person became unconscious like 50 times? But we got two kills inside. Who's got the med kit? You. Fingers crossed. There is no one there. Well, there is. I was going to say, fingers crossed. That was not um, a grenade, but it was. That was a grenade. Okay. I was hoping that that was just a stun weapon. Sadly, not so. However, they both came out. And that's two more dead aliens. <sighs> okay. How are you feeling now? Not bad. Pick your shit up. I might actually pull you back as well. Because you've just been slapped across the butt cheeks pretty hardcore. Uh, that's fine. Don't need it. Um, yeah, you're out to use. Would you need to fire that thing? Not too bad. Nil. Nil. Can I get you there? Not really. Okay. Oh my god, this is so sketchy. This oh, I just love it. Right, you you are really not in a good way. So uh Right, you guys go stand there. Go duck. 
you. You can move in as well. That's pretty much locked down. And you can stand there for token support. Okay, now it's time to move in. I can see one straight off the bat. You. 29. Can't shoot him. Alright. What about you with a stun launcher? You need 25 to launch it. 22. Yeah, alright, you take a nil. Panicked. Good. Squad leader. I don't think you get a lot from squad leaders. So I'm not going to worry about too much. Manual. Oh. Oh, hey, buddy. Get the fuck out of here. can't move which is unfortunate all right let's leave it like that for now not happy with that placement at all well I mean yes that worked no fatal wounds armor soaked it take them alive if we can Or, you know, maybe not, I guess. Snap. What have we got? 58. 62. I'll take it. I want you to move out the way of the door. What have you got left? 59. Ho-ho! Oh, happy with that! Wow! That was profitable. That was very profitable. Oofed. So, actually got one live alien. Only five alien artifacts. We're really not recovering a lot from these, are we? We did lose someone, but it happens. Okay. A hundred zerbites. Holy shit! A hundred! Got some serious uh, improvements there. And 58 aquaplastics. Oh my god. And Nadia, though. I can't believe we lost her. That losing her was actually quite painful because she was quite the veteran. But here we go. Magnetic iron armor. This stuff is amazing. It's only slightly better armor wise than iron armor. But it's better. And better is better, no matter how minute. An enhancement for the iron armor, incorporating the magnetic array technology to allow full freedom of movement in the aquatic environment. Yeah, so basically, uh, as long as we're underwater, we can fly. Um, or float, I guess. So, good stuff. New project. We want... Disruptor pulse launchers. Yes. We can now produce that armor. You know what we're going to do guys? We're going to produce that armor. It's so expensive. But in fact it's going to take nearly all of our Zerbite or Zerbite. But But we need it. So, if we need it, we need it. And how long is that going to take? 
Only eight days. And we will keep the other suits just for replacements for rookies and what's not. So we need need another man. And we also need one of these. Yeah. That's expensive, but Ooh. Sell sack because we need to make up aquaplastics. Iron armor, we actually have two spare suits of that left. Don't need those. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need those. Definitely don't need those. Um Sonic pulses, I mean we've got a lot of those. Eating up storage space. Thermal shock launcher, we've got two of those. Disruptor pulse launch. Wow, we've got three and with ten rounds. We've got so many of these uh, sonic cannons now. Definitely don't need all of those. That's for damn sure. Okay, well that's like a cool 3.3 <laughs> 3 million we just made. You know, that's fine. So whilst we've got all this money, workshop, living quarters, general stores, wider range sonar. Is there anything really we need here? I mean, I guess. Kind of want to get the workshop up and running. Uh, base information. Maybe another lab. Build facilities. Yeah, maybe another laboratory. Get research finished up as quick as we can. Um, that's fine. Want to try and keep as much of this money as possible. <clears throat> okay. Intercept. Triton 1. Um, cancel that for a minute. Let's just... Uh, wow. So many wounded. Um, really want to do that submarine though. Because any chance of getting Zerbite is uh, important. Extremely important. Get on board. Get on board. Iron armor. Have we got any... We don't have any magnetic iron armor yet. That's fine. Okay, well, this might be another slaughter, but I want I want the resources. Is the long and short of it. I want the resources. But hopefully, we can pull another profitable mission. Don't really need anything there. Uh, you're a bit light. That's fine. Where are we? I think we're kind of in the middle by the looks of things. Only six guys. Which is not promising. At all. But that's fine. We shall make it work. Ooh. Right, fellas. Nice to meet you. Okay, so. Let's get this fucking party started. Whoop. Twenty-two. Give it to him. Who's next? You got one? You do. You literally have one. That's fine. Rather have one than none. Grab that nade. Whoop. Give it to him. Nice. Two kills. Happy with that. Whoa.
Well, that was cataclysmic. Very happy with that. Wow, there's a lot of them. So, no sub. No sub yet, anyway. Area clip, more or less. H. I want to try and hold on to H because he just has accuracy for days, man. Another guy. Possibly another one more sniper. Uh, we'll have we'll have two snipers, and we'll have four on the ground. Let's fan out. I guess we can start getting grenades in people's hands. Yep, more armor is always. Oh, you don't have grenades. You have a grenade, but you have the wrong type of grenade. But I guess... Prime. Uh, you can drop it. Give you a little bit of cover moving forwards. Just enough. Alright. Okay, so that's actually the edge there. Good to know. So you guys can start fanning out. There's the sub. Prime, move in. That's not too shabby. Nothing to report. Stay in the cloud for now. Um, There's got to be more of them outside. There has to be. So on that note, I want you to move this way. Oh! Who do you see? Him, right in front of you. All right, H, up on the tower. Snapshot, aim shot, 80%. Make it happen. H, you're not listening to me. Laura, 35, make it happen. Good enough. Good enough. Disappointed, H. Very disappointed. Okay, I think you two are going to move around in a pair together. Stick to each other like flies on shit. Okay, that seems fairly clear, but there is no such thing as fairly clear in XCOM. There is no such thing. You feel comfortable, you feel safe, trust me. You are not. You're a stone's throw from being fucked. At all times. Okay. Possibly need to get some more soldiers as well. Yeah, this is the one that's been shot down as well. Oh! No! No! Sons of bitches! Um. That was a horrible shot. That really was. Prime. Can you, per chance? You cannot. 
What's your strength? 27. H, what's yours? 30. 35? Yep, yeah, 35. Okay. H. Make it happen, bud. I guess he can't. Kind of. I get the feeling this is about to go horribly, horribly, horribly wrong. There he is. You. You, you dirty shit stain. I don't want this guy alive. H. Aim shot, 100%. Kill him. No way. Any more. Let's try and get these guys moving up as well. Oh, I can't believe I lost someone. Fuck you, buddy. Fuck you. That was... Nafula. Good shot, Nafula. If we're not paying you the big buck... Ooh, big bucks. I want to know why not. H, can you make this happen? Thread this needle. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh yes. Needle threaded. Alright, Laura, you're covered. H has got your back. I'm not sure how confident that should make you, but sure as shit could be worse. Okay. Hopefully if we can kill a couple more of them, they should start panicking. Ah, there's a dirty great big hole there. Which is nice. This place looks fairly secure, but again we're going to explore it completely just in case. See if anybody else wants to wander out. Doesn't look like it. Um, Nico. I'm guessing no one's over here. But I, I want to make sure. Twenty-five to fire. So we've got twenty-four left. Okay, that's sketchy. Sketchy, sketchy, sketchy. Ah, oh, but the the entrance to the sub's got to be bare. I'm guessing. Yeah, I don't like that. Right, let's make sure there's nothing over here. Otherwise, I'm going to get paranoid. Last thing we want is one sneaking up when we got our pants down. Which certainly does happen. Ooh! Oh, that was good. Oh, my God. His armor tanked it. He got wounded, but his armor tanked it. Aim shot. Get the fuck out of here, buddy. <sighs> you move in. Neil. Got this area kind of on lockdown. Kind of. Okay. 
She can't really move very far before she can't shoot. You're a little bit better. Surprised they haven't started panicking yet. A little bit disappointed in that fact, actually. It's definitely someone fucking around inside the sub. Which is fine. Guessing there's two left. Maybe more. Right. Let's start approaching from this side. I mean, we've kind of got them surrounded now, but that doesn't necessarily mean too much. They certainly still can get a couple of dirty, cheeky shots in. to fire. Alright. They're probably upstairs. I say probably. It's just waiting for that little green shot to come out of nowhere. That's oh, like that. Knew it. Knew that was coming. Coming out of the entrance. Okay, they've lost a lot of men. They really have. Um, yeah. Wow. I was going to say they've gone silent, but I guess not. Right. Move up. Everybody move up. Just knew that was coming. Didn't know that was coming. Right, you. Snap. Good enough. You. Neil. Make it happen. Connected. Gilman Technician has panicked. That means he's dropped his gun. Oh man, I cannot believe they came out of the side like that. I mean, I can, I guess, but holy shit. They really are trying to defend this sub. Ooh. He had the big nasty weapon. He had the big nasty weapon. Alien artifacts, eight again. <sighs> gutted that we lost someone. Really gutted about that. But. But overall, not bad. We did get more aquaplastics. Shame we didn't get any more zerbite. Because we're going to be using most of that. Building our new armor. Nico. Nico. Yeah, he had eight kills. Again, we're losing a lot of these top high-end people. This is really not, not fantastic. Never mind. Right, let's check out our base. Sell sack. And we did get another disrupt to pulse. We've got six. And look at all the ammunition we've got for it as well. Holy nutsacks. More Gilman corpses. Get rid of those. Magnetic navigation. Nice. Alien learning arrays. Okay, we made another half a million. Happy with that. We'll keep the thermal shock launchers for sure. 
More sonic cannons to sell. Definitely don't need all those bad boys. Okay, we're we're finally, I think, crossing that threshold now where finances are uh, more or less um, sorted. And talking about finances being more or less sorted, let's get this place outfitted with a Barracuda. We'll get it a couple of DUP launchers. Or no, actually, we won't. What we will do, once this armor's done, in fact, stop that new production. Get oof, two sonic oscillators. How long is that going to take? Eight days. Uh, let's put 20 guys on it. 20 more guys. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Actually, how much Zerbite is in this in this place? Transfer. 80. Okay. That's nice. Yeah, we'll just transfer that back to our main base then, because we're going to need that. Radar is almost online, and this place will be uh, capable of intercepting ships soon. Very nice. Right, guys. Anyway, I'm going to have to end it there. I've really enjoyed this episode. Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, things have been going a little bit... Well, I think overall it's positive. But... Um, it, it's not going smoothly, but as XCOM goes, I think we're doing okay. So, thanks for watching, guys, and as always, till next time. <laughs>